Hey friends, it's Travplay. Today I'm going to show you how to beat Kirby. Keep in mind that my guide won't cover everything, and in the end, usually the better player will win most matchups. But these tips and visual examples will improve your character knowledge, so you'll know what to look out for. For competitive stage picking, tri-platform stages like Battlefield are good to use against Kirby. Avoid Final Destination because that's where Kirby has the easiest time approaching. And as for counter picks, Kirby is weak against sword characters who can easily outrange him. And Kirby is strong against characters with poor recoveries and big characters who are easy to combo. Most pros rank Kirby as as mid tier or low tier. So to help you consistently beat Kirby, I'll show you moves to respect and weaknesses to exploit. Let's get right into it. If you're new to Smash, then you probably think Kirby's stone is the best move in the game. You might say that it's unfair how Kirby can just fly above you while you're fighting your friend, and then he just drops on you and there's nothing you can do. Well, I know how you feel. We all do. At one point in time, we've all been there. But let me tell you a little secret. Ready? Just move out of the way. I know, right? Mind blowing. That's how you beat it. Oh, you want more? Okay, here we go. You can grab Kirby out of this move. A good Kirby will see you move out of the way and transform back to normal midair. You can counter this by attacking in the air. A better Kirby will counter that by turning into a stone again, but you can counter that by faking an attack and then punishing on the ground. But then an amazing Kirby will hardly use this move except to edge guard. Now you know. Okay, now let's get serious. You should also respect Kirby's bait and punish playstyle. He struggles to approach, so he'll usually float near you or crouch right next to you and bait you into whiffing an attack and then punishing. Respect this by either increasing the space between you and Kirby or by using only quick moves and making sure that they land. Respect Kirby's edge guard. He has five air jumps, so he can go far off stage to attack you and still make it back to the ledge safely. Kirby can easily carry you off the screen with a string of attacks. Don't get caught in this. If you can't manage to jump or air dodge back to the stage, then you can DI away from Kirby to break out of the combo. Kirby's tilts are awesome, especially his up tilt, which can lead into combos and deal shield pressure. His down tilt is also good at shield pressuring. He uses this to bait you into grabbing because most characters will whip the grab because Kirby can crouch so low. Respect Kirby's inhale. He can copy your character's abilities. Some of the best characters for Kirby to copy are Shulk, Samus, and Hero. If he does copy your ability, then just keep on hitting him. There's a 1 in 32 chance he'll knock the ability out of him. And make sure to not get cheesed by letting Kirby suck you off the stage and gimping you. Kirby has a good grab game too. His forward throw leads into combos and his back throw can kill around 140% of the ledge. And his up throw can kill around 165%. Don't get grabbed. Kirby has a powerful and fiery dash attack, so don't get hit. Kirby's up special, Final Cutter, can cut off your approach from the air. It also shoots a projectile at you for a short distance. If you bait this move out, it's easy to punish Kirby. And for all you casual players out there, here's Kirby's final smash. you need to avoid that big sword Kirby swings in front of him. Before I get into the weaknesses, please hit the like button and subscribe if you want more content like this. I'd really appreciate it and it helps a ton. On to Kirby's weaknesses. His biggest weakness is his approach. He's slow in the air and on the ground, so it's easy to predict his movements. That's why he usually relies on a bait and punish playstyle. Kirby has poor range. That's why most sword characters really give Kirby a hard time. Combining those last two weaknesses means Kirby is weak against a campy playstyle. Stay back, set up a tent, and throw projectiles if you got them. And just maybe, Kirby will rage quit. Kirby is the 8th lightest character in the game, so he's easy to kill at low percents. Since Kirby is a floaty character, he's easy to juggle. So lay in the combos and don't forget to watch out for that stone. Kirby's recovery on its own is actually pretty good, but unfortunately for him, and fortunately for us, his recovery is slow, so it's easy to exploit, like so. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button and subscribe for more. Also, check out my playlist of how to beat every character in Smash Ultimate. There's a lot of info there, and let me know which character you'd like me to do next. See ya!